some shoes. Very controversial shoe, man. Very controversial. I finally won on the sneakers app. <laughs> I'm talking about, man, it's been a long time since I won on the sneakers app. And hopefully, uh, tomorrow, make sure y'all, uh, I'm going to do a raffle for those Jordan 4s. Um, was it Hayes, Tays, whatever they got them. Those brown Travis Scott lookalike uh, Jordan 4s. I'm going to do a live on my other channel, Dan D P O V. I will leave a link to that live podcast. So make sure if y'all want to see me, see if y'all want to know if I can take the L, take the dub. We can just chit chat in the morning. I'm going to do a live stream tomorrow morning around. I'm gonna start around like 8:20, 8:30ish. You know what I'm saying? And we are gonna see if I'm gonna be able to cop those Jordan fours tomorrow live on my damn D P O V channel. Link down below. Ah. Got an unboxing, man. Like I said, I haven't won on the sneakers app in a long time, bro. It's been a long, long, long time since I won on the sneakers app, but I'm definitely interested um, in seeing if this shoe fits. Because I don't even know if it's going to fit. And the reason why that this shoe is probably one of the most controversial shoes, it's, it's not just this shoe. But it's the concept, right? And the reason why I probably titled this video the most controversial Jordan 1 release ever is because the whole women exclusive, right? What is a woman exclusive? Like, that doesn't even make sense to me. You know what I'm saying? It really doesn't make sense to me. Like, does, you know what I mean? Does a, I don't know, does a WNBA player makes a men exclusive shoe? You know what I'm saying? Like, do well, I don't even know if WNBA women even have shoes. But if they do have shoes, their shoes are catered to women, right? The the structure, the feet shape, you know, it's it's catered to women. The feet, the sizing. So do women have men exclusive shoes? Like it, it just don't make sense. Like Jordan is a man. He caters to men. These are basketball shoes. These are performance shoes. These are casual shoes. They for us. Now, the only way it's a woman exclusive, in my opinion, is the colorway. And this colorway does not look like a woman's shoe to me. But anyway, that's why I say, like, the whole women, men, you know, Jordan, Jordan woman, Jordan even though it's a men, it's, it's Jordan men woman. So this is Jordan men woman. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, hey, buy what you like. Fuck the hype. And at the end of the day, you know what I'm saying. I, hey, I don't care if it's a woman's shoe, quote unquote woman's shoe. If I like that woman's shoe, that is a Jordan, because Jordan are made for men. I'm gonna buy it. I don't give. I don't give a damn what y'all say. This is a shoe that was made for women. But even though it doesn't have the women color, whatever. I hope it fits. All right, because this is a size 12. This is a size 12, which is a size 10 and a half in men's. So, hopefully it fits. Hopefully it fits. As y'all see, uh, size 12. Boom shakalaka. This retail for 170 Okay, tell me what is so woman about this. The price point is not a woman's. So how are you going to make a woman exclusive but give us the men price point? Like, that's why I say, like, it's it's like so many dudes, like, just, just these male extra testosterone cavemen fucking, I am man, you are a woman, me no do women stuff, I am man. All right, bro, calm the fuck down. I... I mean, y'all just, I don't know. Some men just gotta be, like, too manly. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, like niggas go overboard by, like, being a man. I ain't touching no woman shit. That's woman shit. I ain't doing no woman shit. But some of you niggas be the most feminine niggas in the motherfucking world. But we ain't gonna talk about that. Let's just talk about these shoes, all right? I don't care what y'all say. I cop. These are here to stay. Not for resale. These are gonna go up in one of these things. And I need to go buy some more black um, shoe containers because 
I'm running out of shoe space. So I need to, matter of fact, tomorrow when I go pick up my uh, Jordans, I'm going to go uh, get some more containers. But anyway, size 12 is a men's 10 and a half. Ooh, I, don't a, I don't care what y'all say. These are here to stay. The silver toes, baby. Yes, sir. The, man, I, I don't care, bro. Hey, these are staying with me. Now, like I said, this is, oh, and then they got that silky. It, <laughs> these are clean, boy. These, bro, I, I don't care what y'all say, man. These hoes is fire, man. And if y'all think this is a woman's shoe, hey, <laughs> it is what it is. I'm going to be flossing in these hoes, too. These these gonna be dope as hell on my feet because I'm going to rock these. Now, speaking of rocking them, right? This is a size 12, which is a size 10 and a half in men. So let me see how this shoe fits. Let me put on some socks. I might, I might, I might slick give y'all a little on foot. Put on some socks. Fuck it. I'm gonna give you a little on foot. How are we gonna do this? Uh, we're gonna do it this way. Alright? Can y'all see? Hold on. I think y'all can see, huh? Alright. That shit, that shit, that shit. Are oh, they gonna fit? Are oh, they gonna fit? Yeah. Oh yeah, these fit. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> My toe is literally right at the tip of the shoe. Damn, these hoes is kind of tight. Oh shit. These hoes is kind of tight. Hey. If anybody has a size 12 and a half, I need to exchange. I think, I think I definitely need to exchange. I mean, I can, I can do it. Let me see. If I take out the, the insole. Let me take out the insole real quick. <laughs> Let me take out the insole because it, I, I ain't gonna lie, it is, it is, it is tight. It fits, but it's tight. And I know when I wear Jordan 1s, I'm gonna be walking around in them a lot. So, took out the... What do you want? Shut up. Alright, took out the... Took out the soul. Yeah. I think I'ma need a size. I'ma need I'ma need a size 12 and a half. Yeah, I think I'ma need a size 12 and a half. So if y'all got a size 12 and a half in these, y'all let me know. I mean I I can It fits. This shit is dirty. Gotta do that old grandma shit. Like, you know your old grandma. If you see you with like stuff on your face, yeah. It fits, but it's just, it's tight. If y'all got a size 12 and a half, hit me up. I would prefer if I can get my size 11 which is a size 12 and a half in women so if y'all got a size 12 and a half in 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 women and y'all want to do an exchange let me know hit me up in on my damn d kicks um it's tight but i don't feel like i'm gonna be able to wear this shoe for a long period of time you know what i mean because normally when i wear jordan ones i'm gonna be walking around i'm gonna be doing my thing in them and if i wear this tight shoe over then 
longer than an hour, my feet gonna be killing me. So I probably do need a size 11. So if y'all got size 11, which is a woman's 12 and a half, y'all hit me up. Other than that, if I can't, I'll just make it do what it do. You know what I'm saying? These are clean anyway. It's your boy DMD signing out. Make sure y'all follow me on my DMD POV channel. I will leave the link for that channel because I will be going live and doing the Jordan 4 raffle. I mean, not the raffle, but the Jordan 4 live cop on, on the sneakers app. Silver Toes. I'm out. Peace.